Subscribe guys, so I'm gonna be doing another video. This time it's gonna be for uh, how to fix the Bayonetta. I think it's something to do with the lag, but I don't know if this will completely fix it. So I'm gonna open up Opera GX. Not exactly, let's, let's look it up. Bayonetta Steam Fix. Because I usually go to this website. This one right here, I think. PC Gaming Wiki, and then it tells you how to fix it. Let's see. Maybe it's the first one. Stutter fix. Let's try that one. Okay, here it is. Just found the fix on for almost seven to stop. No, that's not it. I'm gonna go ahead and download Bayonetta. Then plug the gamepad. The only thing I can think of a fix though is... What was it? Basically changing it to borderless, that's the only thing I can think of. Let's go ahead and download it. Let's see. Go to the library, then I'm gonna download Bayonetta. Install. Yeah, storage. Okay. I'm gonna wait for a bit. This might take. It's pretty big. 13 gigs. Oh, there's other stuff here. It's gonna take a while. It's downloading in maybe 9 minutes till it's finished. Meanwhile, let's look at the fixes. I'm trying to find a fix though. The Netter not launch. Okay, and then what I'm gonna do is start it off real quick. Oops, what am I Go back, go ahead and play it. Go ahead and. First, I'll do it. I'll do the, the fix here. So what I what I did was 
I went to options and then I went to display settings and then what I'm gonna do is go to see this no it's not go to graphic settings and then what I'm gonna do is put it on 1080p since that's my resolution I'm gonna yeah monitor one and then I'm gonna choose because it was on full screen so you can either do borderless or windowed what I did was do borderless and if you want to lower the graphics quality you can change it here you can make it low or high I put mine on high or you can customize it and choose how you want each one I'll just put it on high and that should be it let's look at custom shadow quality high so that's the fix I did and vsync on or you can turn it off I turned mine on you can see your VRAM usage there on the bottom so these are my settings borderless basically and then you click apply and click yes that should save it and then we'll test do a little test run Finally left. Come <laughs> on. 